Students across Kentucky are preparing to return to school, but amidst the pandemic, class would look very different. LAX 18's Katherine Collins tells us how a Fayette County Elementary School is getting creative to welcome students safely back to school. Get back in the groove. It's the theme of this drive through open house at Brenda Cowan Elementary, where students have the chance to meet their new teachers for the first time. But make no mistake, the groove of this school year will look like none other before it. I think we're all still a little uncertain because it is so very <laughs> different from the, you know, from the ways that I grew up learning. Um, so it's kind of that's still a new hurdle for all of us. Amber and Tom Lyons have three children at this school. One of them, a daughter starting kindergarten, received her Chromebook today for virtual learning and met her teacher, Miss Kelly. Hi. I know that she's looking forward to uh, to kind of making that one on one connection there. The virtual start will be a challenge, the Lyons say, but teachers have at least had more time to prepare for it than in the spring. I think that we all feel much yeah. more planned uh, this time. You know, we've had the weeks to prepare and we still have weeks to prepare. The governor has recommended schools delay an in-person start until September 28th. Brenda Cowan Elementary Principal Joshua Williams says everyone will have to be flexible. We're prepared uh, for whatever comes our way. Um, the blessing is we've had time to really look at uh, ways that we can engage and plan for either in-person or uh, virtual or mixtures. It's a challenge the Lions family says they're up for. I'm glad we really are looking at the safety of, of the kids, the teachers, all of the family and everyone involved. Williams says it will be his staff's goal to make sure all kids have the tools they need to learn this year, despite the strange new groove. In Lexington, Katherine Collins, LEX 18 News.